What up, YouTube family? Welcome back, man. Thank y'all for checking in. Hey, check this out, man. I just wanted to make a quick video and just kind of give my opinion on all the hoopla about uh, the AMAs. So, this is my thing, right? I'm not really going to talk about everything that went on. I just want to stick to one core point, right? So, yesterday you had uh, people, you know, coming out. You had Jermaine Dupree. You had Tank. You had Bootsy. Uh, this morning when I get up, I'm hearing that Kelly Rowland had to check somebody. You know what I mean? And it's like, my whole thing is this, as a black community, right? Because we've seen this movie before. Uh, whether it be the AMAs, the VMAs, the Grammys, you know, uh, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, the Country Music Awards, the Oscars, all of these events, we all, it's, it's always somebody in our community that's doing a lot to push the culture forward, uh, always get snubbed, they don't get nominated, sometimes they don't get invited, and then when they do get invited, they go with high expectations. They don't get um, celebrated in whatever kind of way they feel as though they they want it to get celebrated. And it's always an issue in the black community. And we always, you know, get in an uproar and, you know, everybody go on social media and, you know, they they... They, they share their frustration and they vent out how they feel about how they was treated, right? And my whole thing is like, we do this every single time. Black celebrities do this every single time, man. Like you, you won't, they, they say, first of all, every single time it happened, they claim they don't care about it. It don't matter to them. They're not going to even participate. And then they get mad. Now, I don't mean no disrespect to nobody. My whole thing is like, stop seeking validation from people and events and organizations that keep chumping y'all off. It's like, it's like the greatest hits, man. Every time it's an award or something for movies, we got the same thing. People come out, they, 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 they dissatisfied, and, you know, and then here go the threats about, you know, we going to boycott, and, you know, we're not going to, you know, we're not going to participate, and we're going to start our own. When y'all going to start it? Y'all keep... Black Hollywood and black uh, uh, celebrities keep saying every time they get pissed off that they're gonna start their own thing. We're gonna start our own thing. You know, we, you know, you know, F the Grammys, you know, uh, uh, F the Oscars, you know, F this, F that. And then these shows come around again and y'all go like y'all do every single time. Like, it's the hypocrisy for me, man. Like, <laughs> every year y'all get pissed off about something. And then the next year y'all go and do it and go and do the same thing. That's my whole thing. If y'all going to do something, do it. You know, we, we control the culture. We control the cool. Yeah, that may be true. Because <clears throat> I happen to agree with that. For sure. But why get mad every year? Or get pissed off every year when y'all can't have y'all way. Y'all not about to have y'all way in these folks' award ceremonies, man. Oftentimes, it's people that's voting for the nominations that's not that's not even primarily of y'all fan base. And then when black folk go to these ceremonies. If you're lucky to get nominated, somebody may get one award. 
like say for, like the Grammys is always my thing. The Grammys is always a, ooh, <laughs> boy. The Grammys is the Grammys always trip me out <laughs> because me as being a, a a black man and a supporter of black culture and everything that we bring to the table, I happen to feel like it should be several artists that get a ton of Grammys every year. But that's not the case. Like I said, if you're lucky to get nominated, you may get one or two Grammys. It's not often that you see uh, black entertainers go to the Grammys and get an arm full of Grammys. But you see other folk do though. And this every year. And, and, and it's like Y'all folk get mad because you don't get invited. You get mad because you don't get nominated. You get mad because you don't win. You get mad because you ain't asked to perform. I'm like, bro, like it's enough of y'all that can get together and create another award ceremony. <laughs> but to, but they get mad and get pissed off and threaten to boycott and not participate. Don't be a don't. Don't be a sore loser or 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 don't I, that's getting tired, man. Just stop stop saying that. Y'all need to stop saying that every year, every award ceremony, y'all threaten to do the same thing and y'all never do. Y'all always want to be celebrated, always want to be validated by these folks. So respect how these folks handle their business. And until y'all start y'all own thing. Probably nothing, nothing, nothing's gonna change. Nothing has changed, and probably nothing will change. So that's my whole deal about the award ceremony last night, man. You got everybody getting all in their feelings. Come on, bro. It's, get, it's really getting tired for real, man. Because if y'all want to do something about it, y'all will. But y'all want that like, y'all want that attention, y'all want that validation. And so y'all have to deal with what high over them folks handle their business, man. It is what it is at this point, y'all, and y'all know that too. Y'all just want to get some extra attention by, you know, oh, well, you know, we're we going to do this and we're going to, y'all ain't going to do nothing, man. Y'all ain't been doing nothing. Y'all doing, y'all, y'all, about all y'all going to do is what y'all doing now. Saying y'all going to do this and y'all going to do that and y'all ain't going to do nothing. The next award ceremony, y'all will be piled up in the building with high expectations and then get let down. That's my whole deal on the AMAs, man, and the whole Chris Brown situation. And at this point, I don't even know why they canceled Chris Brown uh, performance. It was supposed to be like a 40-year uh, anniversary, a thriller, or something to celebrate uh, Michael Jackson. In any case, I don't. I, I'm not even clear on. I, I, I'm not even clear on why they canceled Chris Brown uh, performance. I, I ain't. If he did something recently or got caught up in something recently, <laughs> I don't know, man. I missed it. So, man, y'all let me know how y'all feel about how everybody all in an uproar about yet another uh, award ceremony where they didn't have their way or they felt snug. YouTube family, man, y'all get with me, man. Let's kick it and let's talk about this, man. Because I'm, I, I, to me personally, I think it's tired. I'm, I'm about tired of it.